Israel is known for its flair and expertise in technology. So no wonder that Israeli high school students are now being taught in smart classes. 300 classrooms in northern Israel and 50,000 students have all gone digital in an effort to change and advance this country's educational methods. We're trying to change the, the educational culture inside the schools and to encourage the teachers and the students to use the technology, the best technology, to be a better teacher, to be a better student. It's a whole new idea of taking out the books and bringing in computers and technology that the students know from home and from the hours outside school, bring it inside the classroom so they can connect to it, make it more visual to them and more simple to understand. All of this stuff together, it's like a, a very big circus for the kids that makes them want to study. The interactive board is the, the main thing that allows me to use the internet online in class. We have the tablet that allows me to write upon it and all the class can see it on the board. I can go with the tablet, it's wireless, so I can go with it in the classroom, explain something to a student in the back of the class, write something that I explain to him on the tablet, and all the class can see it, so I'm not limited to standing near the board. In this class we use the technology to go to the internet, uh, to many sites, and to see many things that uh, we can do in a regular lesson, uh, like uh, to go to YouTube, and uh, to see like, the things that we learn on the the same lesson. I love uh, very much uh, technology. I use uh, computers, uh, I see a, a TV, and when I come to school and I have it uh, here, as, so it makes me happy. I love it. Learning with the smart board, it makes the learning easier. It exposes me to new things that I never uh, knew before or did before. We have a few technologies. One of them is a voting kit with a remote control for each student that are connected to the computer of the teacher. I can ask them a question, each of them votes his answer. During the lesson today, I didn't know the answer to the question on the board, so I vote D, so, um, and no one didn't know about it. So it's not embarrassing if you get the answer wrong. Exactly. Such technology and training was brought over from England and Russia about five years ago following Israel's war with Hezbollah in Lebanon. The goal was to contribute to students in northern Israel and later on in the south in order to reduce the gap between central Israel and the periphery. Upon completion of this $20 million project, 100,000 students will be learning in smart classes donated by international Jewish donors in partnership with the Israeli government and World Ort. The content of the educational material is the same, just we're providing this in a new method that the teacher and the, the child can be uh, speak in one language, in uh, one uh, uh, technology. What do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a doctor. I know that a uh, doctor is uh, someone that uses a lot in technology and uh, uh, papers a lot. So I think it's very helpful. It's uh, changed my life as a teacher. If a teacher usually gets bored when he teaches the same stuff all and over again, all the time I do new things. I have new equipment going in and try new things on the board. It's made me feel alive as a teacher. For JN1, I'm Sivan Raviv in Tirata Carmel, Northern Israel.